to another update on the work we're doing on your behalf. NEVA is the voice of insurance brokers. We are your voice to government and to regulators. It's a couple of big ticket items that we've been working on. We've put a submission into the Senate inquiry on general insurance. We wanted to tell members of parliament and really the whole community the value of brokers, the work that brokers do, the importance of brokers uh, in providing advice, being the trusted advisor of their clients. One of the terms of reference talks about aggregator sites. We've got a real worry about that. We've spoken about that in the submission. We, we will follow that up as best we possibly can as the inquiry continues. Another area which is worrying us a lot is a review of financial ombudsman service and other external dispute resolution schemes. There are suggestions that the FOS jurisdiction should be, in, should be substantially increased. We're not quite sure why, they, why that's happening. Uh, we are participating in industry roundtable discussions with Treasury and others about that, and that's an area where we'll be watching very, very closely indeed. Uh, New South Wales home warranty insurance reforms are continuing on, and we are continuing to stay very close to HBCF, the insurer there that's operating that area and making those reforms. New South Wales is also changing its emergency service funding. We've written to the Premier, we've written to the Treasurer, to say we want to make sure that the new Premier, the new government, continues with those reforms and phases out the uh, insurance levy on the 30th of June as had been previously announced. So they're just some of the things that we're working on at the moment. There are other submissions happening for government, other submissions in Canberra for, treat for the Parliament rather, and so there's just actually quite a lot happening at the moment, but we're out there telling your story. We are the voice of insurance brokers right across Australia making sure your voice is heard by government, by parliament and by regulators.